who do you think would be the the best next mayor and why? Uh, right now, the um, the AIA in yes. Phoenix has, uh, during the primary, we interviewed and had visits with all of the candidates were involved. I believe, uh, I shouldn't say all, I believe four of the candidates, maybe five, were interviewed. Mm -hmm. And we had work sessions with those, those candidates. Mm -hmm. And right now, I believe we're going to see um, an endorsement of a candidate. Mm -hmm. But personally, I believe that the best candidate we have for the future of our city, which could be very critical, because whoever we elect as mayor could be there for, for nine years. Mm. Okay? Right. That's a long time. Exactly. That's a long time to make a difference. We look at what Terry Goddard mm -hmm. made as a difference for our city. Yep. Absolutely phenomenal. Mm -hmm. You know, that is the mayor whose name is on the head of the building plaque on this building. Mm -hmm. And we have to find that potential mm -hmm. of possibility in our next candidate. And I personally, outside of what AIA might be saying, mm -hmm. or any of these, but having listened to all the candidates, I feel very strongly that Greg Stanton mm -hmm. is the candidate that we really need to see as the mayor of our city. Mm -hmm. He has made a commitment to the profession in the conversations we've had that nobody else has, to talk about planning, to talk about a concern for sustainability, mm -hmm. to talk about the values of neighborhoods in the built sense as well as neighborhoods in the downtown and midtown sense to reinforce our, our, our neighborhoods mm -hmm. and so I am very very much believing and will work for the election of Greg Stanton to be the next mayor of the city of Phoenix. It's, it's a chance for this mm -hmm. and we we're, we're look, we need this more than almost any time in, in recent decades. Right.